Hi guys, welcome to the channel and today I'm going to show you my number one attack strategy after the recent balance change. It's still using root riders, let's have a quick look at the army at the bottom of the screen there. One wizard, eight root riders, one minion, that's Michael the minion of course. 16 valkyries, a headhunter and an apprentice warden. Spells going to be three clone spells and an overgrowth spell. We're also going to be using the new max level siege barracks because it is just so good at max level guys for funneling. So on one side of the base max level siege barracks, on the other side king and a couple of valkyries. Here equipment giant gauntlet and rage vial giant arrow and healer puppet grand warden we're using eternal tome and healing tome and royal champion default hero equipment default hero equipment should be okay for your heroes this is just what i'm using for a bit of fun guys so sending those root riders and valkyries use the queen ability if you're using the healer puppet and giant arrow nice and early so you get those healers to help heal your army use the overgrowth spell to shut down nasty compartments perhaps the eagle artillery as well sometimes your troops will go around the base of course to avoid that area but I still think it's good with root riders because it sort of neutralizes the compartment it means they're not going to be taking damage from that whole area of the base use that grand warden ability nice and early guys watch out for clan castle troops and of course clone spells when are you going to use them You've got three clone spells, and those clone spells are great for either Valkyries or Root Riders. I would prioritize Root Riders. One max level clone spell will give you two new Root Riders. Two for the price of one. But Valkyries are good as well. If you can see them spinning around the base, you can use a clone spell here or there. Now, of course, we had that recent balance change nerf to Root Riders. Are they still powerful? Yes, guys absolutely and there he is speaking of powerful the most powerful troop in clash of clans michael the minion damage per second 73 trillion wingspan of four miles he is so powerful so there we go there's our first replay so on to our next attack a nasty looking base but don't worry guys so again siege barracks on one side right in the corner away from those defenses with the king and a couple of valkyries we're gonna take out that corner of the base then on the left hand side we're sending in the queen we're gonna use their ability straight away giant arrow through the base and three healers thank you very much then the root rider spam attack to the right hand side of the queen with the valkyries sending the apprentice warden grand warden as well well, send them into the base maybe a rage spell to help out we're using the overgrowth spell to neutralize the eagle artillery compartment i want to try and time the grand warden's ability to protect the troops some nasty witches from the clan castle there no problem any second now grand warden ability we've still got those clone spells i'm sending in the rule champion at the top of the base the king's helping out beautifully as well and then let's have a look at the clone spells and try overlapping the clone spells sometimes can help move your troops by the way guys so we're cloning some root riders down there by the scatter shot and they're now moving towards the monolith with the queen and guys this is looking really nice and easy as i've mentioned though i do have really high level equipment obviously that helps your pets and your heroes it's just a standard choice is there definitely the spirit fox with the royal champion but guys yeah easy to use spam attack this is the easiest one i could find there's michael the minion you know you're going to get three or four stars when he's on the battlefield loads of root riders left this is absolutely amazing my favorite town hall 16 spam attack so guys hope you enjoyed the video today remember on this channel we do have something called a creator code that's where you can help support your favorite content creator in game by using their code our code is code moose any support would be very nice of you and michael the minion says thank you remember to hit that subscribe button and notification bell join the samoose army have a lovely day and remember guys Remember to practice your funneling.